Howdy everybody, welcome back to another summer season of Snakin' with the Critical. While we removed some invasive pythons, it was a lot drier and slower this year. However, we did see a lot of native diversity that we're happy to share now, so enjoy the video and thanks for watching. My god, look at the size of that cottonmouth. Wow, the thing is thick. I assume this is a female. She's grabbing with a bunch of little baby cotton mouths in there. That's why her lower body is so fat. Awesome. Well, I hope she stays away from the road. Dangerous out here. That's that. the biggest scarlet I've ever seen. Wow. wow. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay, friend. Wow. Hey, it's alright. Damn. It's okay. It looks like a milk snake you'd see at a pet store. Now these pretty much just strictly eat lizard eggs, so that's crazy to me that they could get this big off of lizard eggs. And I'm not talking big lizards either, we're talking those little green and brown adults. Oh my god, he's a spaz. Buddy. Big boy. Huh? <laughs> oh, that was close. <laughs> Nice. Another six footer. Uh, I got bag. some of that. Another one. Damn, he is dripping. Yeah, he is. Gross. Yay! Another Brooks King Snake from another new location this year. Well, these snakes were super on the decline the past 10 years from people we've talked to who have been surveying the area for a while. And I don't know what's happened in the past two years, but they have been a pretty common snake for us on our surveys. We get <laughs> a decent amount of them. It makes you wonder, are they out eating all the baby pythons? Is that what's making them thrive? Very cool. It's Aww. a very pretty one. Look very speckly. Can I see? Thank Do you, you want to explain what you're doing? Yeah, so I'm swabbing this snake to test it for snake fungal disease. So this is a fungal pathogen that's affecting a lot of our native snakes here in Florida and all over the country actually. Um, there's a possible idea that king snakes actually might get affected by it a little bit more because of eating other snakes and so they might come become exposed to it more also. Very cool. Yeah. Very cool. Yep, I got him. Reach around your thumb, your foley. So where like to touch my other finger. Okay, like, yeah, I got it. And now you're gonna pull pretty hard out. Are you ready? Yep. And pull. And yeah. Go. Awesome. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> yep. And you'll learn after your first couple <sighs> that you can hold the tail. <laughs> there you go. Like an expert, uncoil yourself. Just to say, I've worked Beautiful. with pythons and zoos before. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's perfect. Real nice diversity tonight. Look at that nice eastern mud snake. A little sub adult right here. No. Probably about three years old. Little guy. Take no. <laughs> There's talk about them being slightly more prone to SFD too. I've heard that, and I feel like I've seen it. They're um. Say that again. So I think they might. Such a bummer. This is a huge eastern diamondback rattlesnake. Unfortunately, dead on the road. I've never ever seen a live one here. This is my fifth dead one. Just uh, really hard for them to make it across the road. They're a diurnal species, so they cross during the day, and unfortunately, people are out in the day. So they get hit, and it sucks. It takes a long time for a snake to reach this size, so it's a big bummer that he just had to die from a car. Oh, bummer. What you're looking at here is Ganoderma zonatum, a fungal plant pathogen that specifically infects palm species, causing butt rot. Oh, that was so odd. Again? He's trying to talk to us. Oh my god. Alright, we'll go put you down. It's okay, I'm sorry. It's alright. Right. Just want to make sure you didn't get hit by the car. <laughs> yes, yes. Oh, look at that belly. A beautiful little belly. This is a brown water. You want to talk about the brown water? No, I'm getting dis oh, disrespected by mojitos right now. <laughs> <laughs> he wanted to say another word, but... Is that a decent sized snake? Yeah. Yeah, you want to get it? Head's going up here. 
going into the brush right there. See that? Mm -hmm. Nice snatch. Yeah. There you go. Look at that. I'll even get the tail for you so you don't even get mussed in the face. Thanks. No problem. Eight, eight foot. Oh my. She's farting. She's a farting and spraying. Oh my oh. god. She knows what she's doing too. Like the, the whipping it back and forth. She's just spraying that musk. Gross. I'll try and hold it so you don't get it wiped on you. Thanks. <laughs> hey. <Ooh. laughs> what the f that, buddy? When you uh, jump off the car to catch a python, always watch where you're stepping first. We got ourselves a nice big cottonmouth right there, a little, little landmine. Big landmine, actually. So, see a snake over there jumping off for a python. Make sure you just, just check your step. Make sure there's not a big cotton out there. Don't want to take a bite from one of these. That would suck. Holy uh -huh. Hello. Hello. Very curious about us. Hi. Hi. Huh? She came out. passing through. Hello. <laughs> oh. Thank you, lady. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Bye, friend. Oh. Wow. How incredible. Did not expect to see this here. This is a snake that uh, I really don't know how to target here in South Florida, except for going to a couple specific areas. But sometimes we just accidentally find them about once a year. This is the biggest one I've seen, and this isn't even that large of one. That is cool. America's only a lapid. Related to the cobras. This is it, right? Oh, buddy! just saw a huge Brooks King that I only saw its tail and I didn't want to pull it out of its hole so we let it go but look at that a few minutes later we got a nice sized mud snake cool diversity oh. moving out here tonight yeah. Show me the front end of that snake. I saw it had an aberrant patterning down the front. Wow. It's pretty interesting. Oh, look yeah. That. Look at that. That's neat. Wow. Very cool pattern. Is it? Is it? Number two for the night, right there. This is about 10 minutes, even. Head's going this way. It is right there. Let me see, yeah. Good grab. Number two. Oh, oh, you need help? No, I got it. Okay. <laughs> awesome. All right, we're on them tonight. Started off real slow, where we got some awesome natives at first, then we got pretty slow for a couple hours. And I think some movement's starting. Clearly. <laughs> and what you're hearing on this side and on that side are both breeding pools of green tree frogs. I can't see them, but we know by their call. Okay, 
So Python tracks are pretty subtle, uh, especially on dirt roads like this, but it, you're kind of able to see this one pretty well if car drove over it. That was a damn big snake that went through here. I know this is an alligator. The only other thing I hear that'd be doing this is alligator. There's no footprints on the sides like there always is with alligator tracks. And you can even see that just like tubular shape going through the grass right here. Damn. Oh my God, you really can. Yeah. Yeah! Yeah. Nice. Nice! Tell me if you want me to step in. <laughs> you good. I got her. Poor him. Whatever this is, nice 10 footer. Uh, he dude, he's like popping my back right now. It feels great. <laughs> a little massage. <laughs> he is rubbing his. You give me a little back rub. <laughs> I know he's just rubbing his turd in the main right now. <laughs> <laughs> is this a boy or a girl? Uh, it looks, looks like, like a lady. Really? Yeah, it's a lady. Doesn't have a tail. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. Didn't come off clutch. She seems healthy. Oh, boy, yeah. Ow! Oh, boy, yeah. Ow! <laughs> that was so rude. Incredibly. You're so small. Probably born today. You go off the road, little friend. Oh, that yo, baby. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> we saved him. All right, right, little buddy. Can I hold him? He's missing his back left leg. Hi. There you go. You're good. There you go, little friend. Stay away from the road. Looks like the eyes are working. Spotted this little guy. Tiny little baby Florida brown snake. All right, if we can spot this, Meg, we can spot a berm. No dramatic. <laughs> what no dramatic, no dramatic reaction. <laughs> well, that was nice. That was easy. That was easy. We're just doing our last pass out, and uh, she was just like starting to get a little drowsy, and I just like tap her, like, bye, 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 bye. <laughs> <laughs> right here, so. Yeah. Uh, Thanks for sticking around till the end of this video, and look out for our summer part two coming out soon. We get some live rattlesnakes in that video along with some other cool stuff. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.